What's up everyone? Welcome to Planet Crafter, the humble DLC. This is our first episode into the long series that we're gonna do. This game takes a lot of exploring, a lot of crafting, a lot of building and a lot of patience. But most of all, a lot of fun. I enjoy exploring this stuff. I love exploring new kinds of stuff. Every time you think you explored everything, you will explore more. That's the beauty of Planet Crafter. Anyway, enjoy the video and I'll see you next time. Bye! Let's start the Neil DLC. I am very excited. I love the first planet. It's a rough crash. Cool. Looks like a giant peanut. <laughs> <laughs> They're massive. <laughs> okay, what do we have? We have uh, some oxygen, we have some food. We don't have any drinks. Um, okay, let's get started. What's this? This is Planet Crafter. Um, your job is to terraform this planet uh, into an habitable, habitable planet. So right now, if I go outside, there's no oxygen, there's no green, there's no trees, no flowers, no grass, nothing. So you need to trans terraform the planet into a livable planet. It's pretty relaxing, it's dope, it's sick, it's also co-op. Dolomite? That's new. So your main objective is to terraform the planet. But you need to make a base and all the stuff and you need to collect everything and... What is dolomite? And there's oxygen you have to account for. So... That's the hardest part. Uh, I want oxygen tech. I need two cobalt. I don't see any cobalt. There's also meteor storms. Where the heck is the cobalt? Usually it's swarming with them. Maybe one of the asteroids has. Uh hmm. Uh oh. Am I gonna make it back in time? Uh oh. Uh, shit! Where's the ship? Where's the ship? Where's the ship? Where's the ship? Where's the landing pot? Where's the landing pot? Where's the landing pot? <gasps> I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Woo! <laughs> oh wait, I I have, what am I doing? I have an oxygen capsule. Solar storm, yeah, m perhaps. I don't know. I maybe my water level is going down faster now with the solar storm, I don't know. So what I need to do is grab this. Ah, I don't have a deconstruction. I need Mm, need to deconstruct uh, silicon magnesium. Silicon, 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 iron, that's fine. Silicon. So, yeah, you can make a uh, humongous base and stuff like that. So, that's pretty cool. So now I can deconstruct this chest to get extra iron. I can, uh, I don't want to drop you. Because I need to build it quick. I can put it here, I guess. Door, get oxygen. Oh shit. <laughs> I just. <laughs> I just <laughs> uh. 
Now I can delete it again. I get all the resources back. Um, just going out for a little, a little scavenge. Maybe I'll just build up there. What's going on here? Uh, let me check. Do I have enough? No, I need one more titanium. Give me titanium. Thank you. Much appreciated. There we go. Now we have our little base here. Uh, what we want to do is make a tier 2 craft station first. Uh, what do I need for that? Silicon. Oh. Silicon right outside the door. Perfect. So we'll just put that here for now. So it's a, it's a really slow game. You can adjust everything. Uh, so it's more... It's faster to terraform a planet. But I'd rather not. Because I like the immersion. I like the slowness. And if you go... Warning, low power. I don't even use power. What do you mean? So if I remove this, add this, I get another row. I can add this. Cool. What we need now is... Power. We need power first. So I need to make a foundation grid. Only cost one iron. I believe one iron, yeah. And then one iron for a wind turbine. Wait, can we build it? I want to build it up here. Why not? And I need more iron. Okay. It's a really cool game. It has a lot, a lot of secrets in it. Like it's, the game is deeper than you think. Like you see all the surface, and you're like, oh, well, uh, is this it? No. First of all, it's a humongous planet. You need to stay alive. Uh, you need to discover. There's also underground parts. There's hidden bunkers. There's salvages points like that. Which looks pretty cool. Uh, the random chest everywhere. Uh, oxygen. Uh, I can grab the oxygen. Walk to this crate. Uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, Story-wise, the game is... Ooh, pooping. Nice. Uh, you are a convict that has been sent to a planet. Uh, in order to remove your track record of your... Whatever you did. Uh, to get a clean record, you need to terraform a planet. So you've been sent to a planet and you need to terraform it. And like you have all these kinds of caves and stuff like that. Did I just spawn at the edge or something? Hmm. Never knew there was an edge. Uh, I'm gonna edge. Uh. What was it again? Control? Yeah, control. Um, I might as well put it here. There we go, now we got some storage space. Put some coal water in it, dolomite, I guess. Whatever. Okay. Uh, what we need to do is go back. Yeah, all in all, this game is really chill. Very beautiful. Um, I'm surprised that there are no stars. Please ignore any previous attempts to terraform the planet. Welcome to your assigned planet. Your mission is to advance the process of terraforming this world. You will need to generate O2, heat and pressure. First reach 175,000 Ti and create a blue atmosphere. That's the same message as uh, it was on the standard game. Unless it's a uh, Lerma seed or Lima seed. Lerma, Lima, Lerma, 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 Lama. That's a giant iceberg. Okay, hey, veggie tube. Blue. Okay, whatever. There you go. Creating oxygen. So I have this chip. I'm gonna put it in here. Decode. And I unlocked the agility boots. Oh, nice. 
So, tier 2 backpack and Lux inventory and look at 300 TI. Okay, well, that's not gonna take extremely long. Need another freaking windmill. Is that enough? Fuck me. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, but I need to make that. Ice, 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 baby. Another veggie tube. Put you in there. There we go. Now we'll go. Oh, tier two backpack is unlocked. Yes, silicon titanium. Tier two backpack. Yeah, buddy. This is not a closed off cave. Huh. Interesting. To say the very least. Usually those caves are blocked off by ice or something and you need to unlock them. Uh, the further you progress, uh, there's usually like an ice wall in front of it. And you need to wait until the planet is warm enough and it will defrost. Oh. So this will make cobalt. This will make aluminum. That will make the rare ores cool. Okay. Interesting. Tier 2 oxygen. Let's go. So much better. Agility boots. Two fabrics and two aluminum. Well, I don't have aluminum. I have one fabric. That's about it. Hmm. Titanium iron. It's probably gonna... No, it's not gonna cancel my... Uh... Oh, it made silicon. Huh. Weird. Okay, 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 hang on. I'm gonna... I'm gonna put you right there for now. Why did that cut my power? Why did that... I already had it. Whatever. Why am I even building? I'm going to move it anyway. So what I want to do is move the entire base, because it's not that huge yet, to that location over there. Or at least close to it. I think that will be a neat location. So I'm gonna gather stuff to make a quick base with the door, what I did before, so I don't die. And I hate that I cannot put it on top. I did not need to put it there. I need to move everything over. Everything over. Wait, I'm gonna check the other side first. If I really don't want it on the other side of this. I don't know why I should, but... Yeah, 
you know, th there's also going to be water, so this might be a perfect place where water will be. Just like there as well. I like this. I wish I could disassemble the, disassemble the entire place. I wish I could move all the power supply over here. Also, I need to start there. I need to build immediately. The other place, because I'm going to build a storage room. Yeah. So we'll take off. Looks into it is interesting and it's really relaxing. There's no enemies or stuff like that. It's just building, surviving, you know, exploring. There's also a vehicle in this game. And I'm actually really happy that I bought this game back then. I'm I'm okay. Well I'm a unicorn now. Yeah. Now we'll have enough power for days. There we go. That's enough power. So. Damn. These storms. Um. Eventually you can send satellites up into the sky. I'm not going to spoil everything, but eventually you can uh, send satellites up into the sky that has certain ores in them. Uh, I mean, there will come a meteor shower and, and all the meteors have special ore in them. It's just a little boost. Some kind of boost. Because it also costs a lot to send one up in the air. Um, yeah, so I don't need that. I do want that one, that one, that one. I have a lot of space left. I want this one. Uh, I want these three. Yeah, okay. And this piece of iron. <coughs> so it's really cool. Like, what you can see now is... Not even one, one fifth of the map or one tenth of the map. I don't know, because it's 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 huge. It's absolutely huge. And you slowly build up to better gear and better housing and increased uh, terraforming stuff like that. But that makes sense, right? So I had two of these. I had the heater. What else did I? Oh, the drills. Uh, let's see. I mean, they're small drills, so I don't care where they go. Later, you have huge drills. Let's unlock some stuff. Uh, tier 1 mining speed. That's good. Microchip compass. Uh, I don't have any use for a compass. You need it later though. Tier 2 agility boost. Ooh. I like that. Tier 2 mining speed. Okay. Living compartment corner. That's uh, just for looks. But uh, this one is pretty good. I need two super alloys. I already found one, but I need a second one. So every chip is another upgrade. Yes. Yes, until there are no more upgrades. You don't know what you will get, but it's the beginning of the game, so you get low tier stuff. So it gradually will go higher and higher, of course. That makes sense. Because if you get, if you get a, a, a tier 4 agility boots right away, you have it unlocked. But you cannot make it because you don't have the stuff for it. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. But in the beginning you will get low stuff, of course. It's it's slowly building up. So it's like every game. Especially this game. It's everything builds up really slowly. Wait, can I um 
I need this one. Iron, cobalt, silicon. Okay, cobalt, iron, silica. I need this one. Now you can see the oxygen, heat, and pressure that you are uh, producing on this planet. They all add up for the thermoformation. Jesus Christ. My English is dead. <laughs> so yeah, if you want this game, use code FreakyFranky and get 10%. Oh, no, I'm kidding. I'm not sponsored. <laughs> that would have been wild, though. Where the hell did you come from? A wild aluminum? Alu aluminum? Aluminium? Tree backpack, let's go! Hey, nice. Now we can see how much power we have left. We uh, oh, we have a lot. We have a lot. Thirty-nine. Because you need, you always need everything, and everything is like you never have it. Need more boxes. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, I hate this so much. I'll put the boxes there. Whatever. It's uh, just don't look at my boxes. It's uh, fine. Here we go. And we have a little little lookout. You can go up uh, like really far. This one. Yeah, there we go. 4% towards the blue sky. So eventually you get a satellite as well, like you, you get a map and stuff like that. You actually have to send out a satellite to get a map. There is a bit of realis realism in here. This is an icy planet. I wonder how bad the water flood will be if it heats up how high the water will be but we're gonna find out that's that's a really condensed white ice snow Ooh. i see shinies okay so this will be melted eventually at 100 nk we're not even close to that so but eventually it will melt and it reveals a new area. And that is tough. I want. I don't need it right now, but I do want it. Uranus. Uranite. Okay. Oh, what is that? What the fudge? A uranium rod, no fucking way. Another uranium, it's exactly the same chest. Almost exactly the same chest. Okay. Okay, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, this is crazy. There's a thing in there. That's crazy. Like, in, in the freaking ice wall? Is that gonna melt? Is that gonna reveal itself or not? Like, I, I, I see it, but I don't know if it's gonna melt or not. This is insane. Maybe. I, I don't know. I know this is going to melt at some point And it's uh, going to reveal a new area. But I don't know if the entire planet will defrost eventually. Like all the ice and snow. Will it, will it be gone or not? 